A trio of ancient shipwrecks recently were discovered in different parts of the world. The oldest was in Serbia. Earlier this month, archaeologists unearthed a ship from the Roman Empire dating back to the 3rd century AD. The ship was found in what's now the site of a massive open pit coal mine. It's on the site of what was once the Roman city of Viminasium. The settlement was home to some 45,000 people and sat near the Danube River. An excavator accidentally found the ship's timbers earlier this spring, but the work had to halt temporarily because of coronavirus restrictions. As you can see, the front portion of the boat was remarkably intact. Researchers say the boat measured 19 meters in length. It had a flat bottom, a sail, and six pairs of oars. Two smaller boats were also found nearby. The 1,700-year-old boat will one day go on display at a museum outside Belgrade. And experts say there's more to find at the site. Only 4% of the area has been uncovered so far. Archaeologists found a 200-year-old shipwreck off Mexico's Caribbean coast. They think the ship was of English origin from the late 18th or early 19th century. Much of the ship has been reclaimed by the sea, but underwater archaeologists were still able to find a cannon, an anchor, and pig iron ingots in the wreckage. The pig iron may have been intended for use as building material. This part of the Caribbean is a fertile ground for shipwrecks. This is the 70th wreck of its kind found in the area. And in the U.S., a storm recently revealed the wreck of a steel boat. The skeleton of the craft was found in Utah's Great Salt Lake. On its Facebook page, the Great Salt Lake State Park said the boat likely dates to the turn of the 20th century. The park's manager told the Salt Lake Tribune that the 30 to 40 foot long vessel may have been one used by the Southern Pacific Railroad, which built a causeway across the lake. This is InsideEdition.com.